Hello lovely bloodsuckers, and I can finally get a 10, at least one version of a 10. It's the 25th century Dueling Heroes 10, um, because it's a lot cheaper. Normally I can't buy these because I just don't have the money to buy stuff like this. Uh, I wanted to get at least a few packs of the new set as well, but my Walmart is out of them. So, we are going to only be opening the 10 here. But, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. Okay, so let's see what quarter century promo we get. Oh, is that... Ooh, okay. Okay, we get, uh... I'm probably out of focus here. We get, uh, what's the name? I'm looking at the name, I can't even say. Black Rose Dragon for our quarter century promo, and I'm happy with that. Because I actually really love Black Rose Dragon. So, to get this as a quarter century promo, I'm very happy with that, and I like that I just got the 25th, I don't think y'all can really tell, but it's got the 25th century logo like right here in the center of the text, that's transparent, so I like that, that'll be definitely be getting sleep. Okay, now for the Mega Packs, which of course is just three, but each has 18 in them I believe, so... And we are going to do the card trick for this. So, I know some people don't, but with Yu-Gi-Oh cards, I like doing the card tricks. So, one, two, three. Front. Okay. First, we get... Uh, ow, I just hit my knee. Baku the Beast Ninja, uh, Mary Melfi's, Freda Plant, a Boofalik, I can't say that last part, but a Freda Plant card. Uh, we get oh Brandon Lost, which I think I got oh, Brandon Lost in the last packing that I did. But this one's a uh, uh, So, if I don't know exactly the rarity, I do apologize. Uh, with Yu-Gi-Oh, I always have tell trouble telling what the rarities are. Ooh, okay, and then a shiny we get... I can't even read that name. Uh, hold on, let me... Oh, it's a runic card, okay. It's... Reke the runic faints. Let me let y'all look at it again. Sorry, I had to move it closer because I couldn't... The name was too dark for me. I couldn't read the name. Now we get runic destruction. Okay. Ooh. Nice and pretty. Ow, dang it, I did it again. Uh, this is Pastel. Pastel. Uh, oh, oh. Hold on, I, give me a second. I'm trying to read this. Pascal, I shouldn't have done that right there. Pascal. Convertrod, I think that's how you say that. And now we get Blazing Castera the Vitrosis. I think I don't know what rarity this is. Um so some of y'all are gonna probably have to tell me what the rarities are because as I said I know some of the rarities, some of them I don't. With Yu-Gi-Oh, I've always been 
um, bad with knowing the rarities. And this is Blondoris, the Avenant Adventure. Which I don't play Blondoris. I know we can play the Master Doll. Uh, Scarecrow Decon. Now it's not focus. Uh, Grand Tusk, oh, a nice dragon card. A uh, Grand Tusk dragon. And Jisu Art Notebook of Mystery. Uh, Archfiend's Ghastly Glitch. Zombie Reborn. Okay. That would be nice if I ever build a zombie deck. Um, Scarecrow Claw Balon Thunder Discharge Wallow Founder of the Drudge Dragons. That's a nice card. And Black Queen Twin Shadow. So I think I got some good uh, rarities from this one. And I just didn't realize it. So I do apologize if I didn't react very well to them. As I said, um, I have trouble with the rarities for Yu Gi Oh! to tell them what is what. Like, I know. Okay, so like, I know this is quarter rare. For a century rare. Um, well, quarter century secret rare, apparently. But I've mostly, even though I do collect Yu Gi Oh cards as well, I've mostly collected Digimon cards for my life more than Yu Gi Oh. So the, the rarities I am not that familiar with, I just know some of them. This one we got. Do I can get in focus here? Am I getting in focus? So I can see? Oh my god. I need to back this up a little. Uh, oh, that's the uh, Amorphage Rarity. I'm not Amorphage Rarity. Uh, the Amorphage Ritual card. Uh, Amorphage. Uh, Amorphid, Amorphid Director, the Imaginary Draco Lord. Fair Welcome Labyrinth. Uh, I that's a Liberal Answer, right? Yeah, Liberal Answer, Maggie Girl. My eyes are a bit blurry, so... Either my phone's out of focus or my eyes are blurring on me. Oh, Nightmare the Dark Bounder. Okay. Oops, I wanted to do that. Smoke Mosquito. That's for uh, the Venture Archetype, right? Uh, Wandering Griffin Rider. He's part of the Venture Archetype, I know. Dynamorphia Domain. Oh. I think this is my first Bestial card, too. Uh, the Bestial Labellion. Uh, I don't play Bestial, not even Master Duel, but. This is a nice rarity, I think. And it's nice to have this card, so... I'll take it. Cash Terror Birth. That's another archetype I don't play. Scarecrow Alternative. 
So I haven't played TCG for a very long time. Um, I think the last time I played TCG was 2010, maybe. Carry on. Uh, Air Glow, I believe that's how you say that. Light Law Medium. Another Ninja, Ninjutsu Art, New Book of Mystery. Rick at Kong Con. Terrors of the Oberon. What is this? No, this isn't considered, uh, I was gonna say this is considered a Wicked God card, but it's not, isn't it? What is this considered? What type of arch type would this be part of? Uh, if anyone knows, tell me. XX Collusion. Fun fact, I actually just pulled this card in Master Duel. Uh, I think it was a Legacy Pool. Maybe. Supreme C Mare. And another Dynamorphia card, which is Dynamorphia Light. Oddly enough, it seems like with a lot of packs that I pull, rather be on camera or not, I get Dynamorphia cards a lot. And they're mostly the traps and sometimes the fusions. So I might try to build Dynamorphia, who knows? For TCG. Easy. Okay. One, two, three. Okay, let's see. We got Black Feather Whirlwind. Or uh, static radiation. Melfi Penny. DDD Headhunt. That's a good track, man, I think. I haven't played DDD or DD for a long, long time either. Uh, Cells Band. Spell Bond, okay. And Agent of Destruction, Venus. Ooh, she's pretty. I like her. Oh, 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 oh. This is, uh, what rarity is this? I know I've ran in a couple of them, but I didn't think I'd get one of the red eyes. Technically, it's a red eye zombie, but still. I love zombie cards, okay? So, even though I'm not that much of a zombie player anymore, I definitely love zombie cards. And one of my favorite cards is the red eye zombie dragons. And so, to get a, this, uh, this is. Not quarter century secret rare, but this is close to it, I believe. And some, so some of the other cards that I showed y'all. Uh, but to get this for him, Red Eyes Zombie Dragon Lord, I'm very happy with that. Okay. Okay, another beast steal. Beast steal. Magnum. Magna. Magnum Hunt. Brand and Explosion, XYZ Combine. Oh, that can come in handy for the new cards coming and stuff, and the old ones too. Dynamorphia. So, see, that's what I mean. Almost every pack, even with this, I've gotten a lot of um, Dynamorphia cards. So, I might try to buy Dynamorphia for the TCG if I ever play it again. Because I got a lot of traps and spells, and well, not really spells, but I got a lot of the traps and the, a lot of the fusions. So we'll see. Uh, 
Hey Kyle, the flying buddy. Oh, look at the kitty. Runix my install and so this is my first time. No, actually it's like my second time getting rune cards. Dynamorphia Reversion. Ice Shade Erosion. Okay, now this is the first time getting an Ice Jade card. I've had Ice Berry, I believe. But not Ice Jade. So this is my first Ice, ice Jade. Scarecrow, Acro, and for the final one we get, oh my god it's the Cucumber Horse. <laughs> I bet you I'm the only one to draw, that have luck to draw this Cucumber Horse. I don't think I've seen anyone draw the Cucumber Horse. So this, I'm probably going to be the first person drawing with a cucumber for of course. They had the look to draw it anyways. But I drew the cucumber horse. Uh, well, since that's it for the packs. I love you all. Hope you have a wonderful day or night depending on you watching this. Mwah.